Um, yeah, it's it's been a, a long run for me. Um, I was involved in the, the previous two uh, World Cup pre-seasons um, in the start and selection. So I think, you know, all the work over the last few years, it's, it's paid off to be here now. But I think the mindset going into it is it's, this is just the start, you know. Obviously, a massive honour to be selected for the squad, but um, this is just the start of it. And I'm going to put my, like I said earlier, put my best forward, contribute to the team as well as I can this weekend. Um, and yeah, I think if, you know, I nail my role and everyone else does theirs, we can put in a, a strong performance. So. Briefly for me, that's a long, long road. Did you ever feel it wouldn't happen? <laughs> um, no, I always, always believed I was good enough uh, to be a, um, you know, a, a, I think selection balls were tight the, in the last World Cup. So um, yeah, I mean, I kind of, since the, since the last World Cup, I've been heavily involved in the squad since then, and you know, I um, really enjoyed my time uh, under Faz um, and the leadership of the, the coaches. It's been it's been a great four years. Um, yeah, I'm just just ready to go now. Roots and Ashton Sorry. Um. Yeah, look, I think in terms of percentage-wise, um, yeah, the standard hasn't been where we want it to be in the lineouts. But you know, part of part of that is preseason, and you know, we're trying different things. There's different combinations every week. Um, we try new moves. So, and a lot of it, if you if you go back and look at it, it's very fine margins. Um, you know, from from to get 100% to to 80% or whatever it is. So. Um, like we have a we have a great uh, group of guys, the lineout leaders who come up with the calls along with Paulie, um, and the strategy is, is really good. So I think this whole this whole week we've just been focusing on on Max draw and, and nailing our individual roles because, like I said many times in the lineout, there's so many factors that <coughs> contribute to a, a well worked lineout. So you know, if everyone just got to keep nailing their process, nailing their role, uh, we back ourselves to, to to go well this weekend. I think uh, a bit of that comes with, with my age. Um, um, so, sort of, you know, I've had the, the experiences over the, the last four years. I mean, like we say it all the time. Any time you play for Ireland is a massive moment. Um, and so over the last sort of four years, I've you know, been in around, had a few games. Um, so like, I know what it's all about now. And yes, there's obviously a bit more more hype around the World Cup and uh, a bit more pressure on games, but. Like that's that's what we've been building for. That's what we've been working towards. All the work as a team, the work with Gary, our mindset coach. Like this is what it all accumulates at. So I think, like personally, I feel like I'm in a good place, and I know that, like the squad as well. Like we've been gelling really well, and um, I think we feel really confident coming into this into this competition based on our past performances and our abilities. The heat is a big factor as well, Gary. It's quite a pretty quiet today. Get the weekend there for Saturday. Yeah, it's it's tough. It's obviously a physical um, battle, but it's a mental battle in the heat. Um, thankfully, we've over the the preseason lead up to this, we've played in, where we trained in Portugal and went hard there. And um, we obviously, we're in we were in Biarritz uh, or Bayonne. Um, granted, the game wasn't in in the heat, but uh, training all that week was, and then even this week, um, training on hard on Tuesday, Wednesday, in the heat, kind of getting prepped for it and. Um, yeah, it's, it's. I suppose it's the same for everyone. So you, you kind of gotta get yourself physically ready, but mentally ready for for that extra bit of challenge that that brings. And um, we've spoken about it, and I'm gonna try and embrace the challenge. Thanks, Kevin. Love is one of the more experienced guys. You've worked under some different captains, different characters. What kind of leaders, John? Is that? Um, I think Johnny is probably one of the most competitive guys I've, I've ever played under. Um, and I think that's his that's his massive point of difference. Um, he's unbelievably driven. Um, he drives the standards, um, training, off the pitch, everything. Um, he's got an incredible winning mindset. So he's the kind of guy you really want to follow into battle because um, you know he's going to be right up there at his best, giving it his all. Um, and it's been great having him back. He's obviously been training with us the, the whole time, and 
you know, having his competitive spirits. Um, he's been leading the team um, that's been sort of prepping the, the match day squads over the last uh, few weeks. And to have him back in the mix fully, um, his leadership has been great this week. So, yeah, good to have him back.